section 103 the celestial said through thy favor it is that all born beings of the four kinds increase and thy and they being created propitiate the dwellers of heaven by offerings made to the gods and the names of departed forefathers thus it is that people protected by thee and free from trouble live depending on one another and so increase now this peril hath befallen the people we do not know by whom our brahmanas being killed during the night if the brahmanas are destroyed the earth itself will meet with a destruction and if the earth cometh to an end heaven will also cease to exist o mighty harmed one o lord of the universe we beseech thee to act so that all the worlds protected by thee may not come to an end so it may please thee vishnu said he calls to me is known the reason of the destruction of the born beings i shall speak of it to you listen with minds free from tribulation there exists an exceedingly fierce host known by the name of kalakeyas they under the lead of ritra were devastating the whole universe and when they saw that ritra was slain by the sagacious indra endued with a thousand eyes they to preserve their lives entered into the ocean that abode of varuna and having entered the ocean abounding with sharks and crocodiles they had night killed the saints at this spot with the view of exterminating the people but they cannot be slain as they have taken shelter within the sea they should therefore think of some expedient to dry up the ocean who save agastya is capable of drying up the sea and without drying up the ocean these demons cannot be assailed by any other means hearing these words of vishnu the gods took the permission of brahma who lives at the best of all regions and went to the hermitage of agastya then they beheld the high souled agastya the son of varuna of resplendent miyam and waited upon by saints even as brahma he is waited upon by celestials and approaching him they addressed the son of mitra and varuna at the hermitage magnanimous and unswearing and looking like an embodiment of pious works piled together and glorified him by reciting his deeds the deity said how were formerly the refuge of the gods when they were oppressed by nahusha thorn of the world that he was he was thrown down from his thrones of heaven from the celestial regions vindya the foremost of all mountains suddenly began to increase his height from a wrathful competition with the sun that is to rival him in altitude but he hath ceased to increase as he was unable to disobey thy command and when darkness hath covered the world the born beings are were harassed by death but having obtained thee for a protector they have attained the utmost security whenever we are beset by perils thy reverence is always our refuge for this reason it is thy we solicit a boon from thee art thou ever grantest to the boon solicited of thee handed to the 103rd section in the tirth yatra parva after one parva